this man very, very disappointed. He knows how important it was to get to that final to keep the chase on Nicky Pedersen. He seems like he's getting away with it so far this year. Yeah, especially from a points point of view, because of course, six for a win in the final, four for second, two for third. So Hancock is going to miss out with a big cash prize there. Nicky Pedersen on 17, Hans Anderson. Wow, how did he get through? On six points, he got through to the semis. He's now on nine. Jason Crump and Chris Harris. Well, he's on the outside again. Could look you say at, he could win it? Look at the little game. Chris is right up against uh, the current world champion, Jason Crump. Come on, boy, let's race for it. Not at all intimidated by Jason Crump, but the experience of Crump comes through. Or does it as Harris comes back? Out front, though. Great start from Nicky Pedersen. Second is Hans Anderson from Denmark. It's a Danish 1-2. But Chris Harris is going real deep, trying to get the momentum. Here comes the current world champion up the inside. Take it from you. Yeah, what cheek. Chris Harris is holding off the world champion in the final. Never thought I'd see this. Great stuff by Nicky Pedersen. He's been putting all night. And I don't think Hans Anderson's going to challenge him at this point. It's all a question of who's going to finish on the podium. And I can't see Jason Crump at the moment going to make... Well, maybe he can go down the back straight and hold off Chris Hans with some pressure on him. This is the best in the world. And it's Nicky Pedersen that's leading it. Go ahead here. If he wins this race, John, he's going to know the point in the whole series so far. Hans Anderson wants to make sure he loses a couple of more. Hans Anderson again putting him under pressure, but I don't think Nicky's going to be too worried, and as you say, it's been a monumental start to his campaign, and Pedersen is literally sitting in the armchair. A little bit of a run there as he comes across the line, but he takes victory number two out of two. What can you say about Nicky Pedersen? Well, he was world champion in 2003, and he's very much looking as though he's on course for 2007, especially with the current world champion, Jason Crump, not able to beat a junior. No, that's right, you know, everything is, is working good. And as I said, I didn't really feel 100% to start with today, but we're cruising in there, you know, and uh, focused all the way, and uh, we managed to find the right setup today again and on a different engine, so uh, I'm very happy. Of course, you know, I'm very enjoying it. I'm trying to not think of anything, you know, because it can collapse any time. And you get the guys right behind you all the time. And uh, I'm just enjoying myself and trying to focus and find the right setup for every single race. You know, I'm, I'm so happy and pleased. The boys did well tonight.